Hello everyone, this is Baby Honest 5273 here, and today I'm gonna I'm back for another rare toy that I will be reviewing today. So this one, um, I don't think almost like literally nobody else owns this in the entire community because it's like literally that kind of rare. I mean, you can guys, you guys can clearly get this on Cow Depot, and you know, I think there's like one or two more people that might actually own this. So, you know, it, it's kind of not that rare, though, because it's on the site. Although, I'm having, I haven't checked within a year, so this could be out of stock. I don't know, but for now, it's pretty much a rare toy because you can only get it on that site. But anyways, today we're going to be reviewing the Cow Cone Puppet from Neighborhood Animals. This was actually the first Cone Puppet I've actually got, and I own, and, you know, I only got two Cone Puppets from BE. This and the Donkey Cone Puppet, which I won't be reviewing till October, because, you know, clearly, you know, it, I'm not going to really say, because I'm sure you guys are know already. But, yeah, this is actually one of my favorite Cone Puppets from BE, besides the Donkey and the Penguin Cone Puppet and the Tiger. This one has to be, like, one, like, in my top five. This was also used in Wii School, by the way, um, in classical toys. Um, but, it, you know, this probably wasn't the same one as the used in Neighborhood Animals. Same thing goes with the Donkey Cone Puppet, because that was also in Wii School. I honestly don't know if they used the same ones as they did, um, like, 16 years ago. To the, um, or actually, no, like, 20 years ago or something like that. Because, you know, Neighborhood Animals came out, like, 20 or 19 years ago. Not sure if they had the same one, but I'm guessing they probably got new ones. I don't know. I'm going to have to check. But I do know that this is actually um, one of the rarest cone puppets right now. Um, I believe this was also used in another BE ripoff um, thing. I, I forget the name, but I think it was like in the scene with the sugar plum dance. Along with another Petra Toys, um, Cone Puppet. I don't know. But, um, yeah, I got the, um, let's just show the story, um, of how I got this. So, la I got this on the Cow Depot site last year for my birthday. And I was pretty surprised, because this thing was actually pretty expensive. It was like 20 to 30 bucks. But although I, I'd say it's probably worth it. I, they have, like, a bunch of cow stuff on that site, and I think including... A cow ramp locker from Petra Toys. I I forget though, but um, you guys can check on the site if you like. But um, yeah, it's it's kind of a pretty cool site that only sells like cow shit and all that stuff. But um, like I said, it's actually pretty cool. I mean, they got stuff like this, and you know, when I first saw it, I was pretty surprised. In fact, I actually have the GIF on Pinterest of this stuff. If you guys want to look, go on my Pinterest, and then you'll find the GIF of this. I have a, like a board of all of BE gifts I really need to update. Of that I really need to update because I don't think I've updated that for an entire year. And you know, I found a bunch of BE gifts over the time, so yeah, that I definitely need to update. So, anyways, this was one of them, and you know, when I found it, my mom immediately got it for me. <laughs> like I keep yawning today. I don't know why, but anyways, um, the cow cone puppet. Um, I actually, um, you know what? I'm not. Fuck. All right, you know what? So I'm just gonna. So let's just. Yeah. All right, you know what? Let's just skip to the details already. So um, I'm a little bit um speechless today. So obviously, you know, it has that um. The um, hair, which is the um, yarn hair, I think. It's made out of yarn, I think. It's pretty cool. Um, it also has like a stuffed nose, a lot of stuffing in it, along with the eyes that are pretty much just looking that way. It should be looking at you then. I don't know, but they also have like a leathered ears and horns. And the best of all, they have a bell on the bottom.
probably the most uh, best technique of this turn puppet. It also has the original um, cone on the bottom as they used in Wii School, so. Definitely Count Depot was probably around for a little bit of time. And also, if you can just let me go get the thing real quick, I also still have the tag that it came in. So give me a second. I actually have two picture toy tags. One for the cow cone puppet and the other one for the uh, elephant walker that I actually got on the Petra toy website. But, um, you know, let's just um, exclude this one. This is the one that we're looking at right here. Obviously, you know a difference already between that one and this one because it says uh, puppet collection on there. Um, I don't know what year this was made in, but I'm guessing this was... My guess is that they made this in the early 90s, I think. Or late 90s. That's my guess. Although it is pretty cool. I actually like this con puppet a lot. I actually haven't made a clip of this yet for my other channel, but since now I have a tripod and, you know, everything in black background, I think I might be able to do it since I already did one for the Donkey Kong puppet. But yeah, um, wish this review was a little bit longer, but um, that's it for today, guys. I um, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.